Okay. Yeah. Good afternoon, fellow people. May the Lord bless you once again. And may the face of God shine upon your life. And may the will of the Lord be done upon your life in this year of 2019. And may that same will of God carry you to next year, 2020. There is something that is going on in social media all over the world that we must address it. Many people think that Jesus Christ is not the only way to the kingdom of God. But I'm not against it. But the truth must be said. In John chapter 8, verse 32, the Bible says, And he shall know the truth, and the truth shall set him free. So what will set you and I free is when we know the truth. And how can we know the truth unless the truth has been declared or proclaimed unto us? Romans chapter 10. Bible says when you read it, it said, How would they hear the message unless a messenger has been sent? Let us look at John chapter 3, verse 3. It said, And Jesus answered and said unto him, Very, very, I say unto you, except a man be born, be born again, he cannot see the kingdom of God. Who said it is Jesus. So here Jesus has come as the way. That said John chapter 6 verse 14. Bible says, and Jesus answered and said to them, He said, I am the way, the truth, and the life. I am the way, the truth, and the life. He said, no one come to the Father except through me. So the rumors and the doctrine that is moving in the atmosphere that Jesus Christ is not, is, 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 is not only the way to the kingdom. This is what the word of God is saying. That Jesus Christ of Nazareth, the one who came to die to save humanity from their sins, is the only way, the truth and the life. And no one if I don't say no, it means no, it means you cannot enter the kingdom without Jesus. You cannot enter into the kingdom without the name Jesus. He said, Very, very I say unto you, except a man is born again. Born again simply means having a new life, having a new identity. And Jesus Christ is our new identity. In the book of 2 Corinthians chapter 5, verse 17, the Bible says that, Now therefore, if any man be in Christ, is a new creature. All things are passed away. Behold, everything becomes new. When we read verse 18, it said, For God has reconciled us back to him through Jesus Christ. God has reconciled the world to him through Christ. And through Christ has given us the ministry of reconciliation. So the only way to go to God, the only way to get to God is Jesus Christ. Whether we accepted it or not, the only way that God said to his word is Jesus Christ. This and this, a lot of doctrine is coming up. A lot of doctrine has been proclaimed. A lot of people have been confused. It was said that people are saying that men of God have not seen the truth again. Men of God become liars because of the doctrine that some of us we preach. But I'm here to announce to you that the only doctrine that is the genuine doctrine is the real doctrine that we cannot take it out. We cannot. We cannot deny it. Is what. In 1 Corinthians chapter 15, verse 1. Let's go there. 1 Corinthians chapter 15, verse 1. 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 He said, Moreover, brethren, 
I declare unto you the gospel which I preach unto you, which also you have received, and with wherein you stand, by which also you are saved, if ye keep in memory what I preach unto you, unless ye believe in vain, this is the gospel, for I delivered unto you first of all that which also I receive, how that Christ died for our sins according to the scriptures. One. So Jesus did. We got to know from the scriptures. Then second. How and, and that he was buried that he rose again the third day according to the scriptures and that he was seen of Cephas then of the twelve after that he was seen of about 500 brethren at once of whom the greater part remain unto this present but some are asleep so the problem is that Though the message or the gospel has been declared to us, the real gospel about Christ that Jesus Christ was arrested, he was crucified on the cross, he died and resurrected. But some of us are asleep. So, because we have asleep, we are just moving on like a wind, that the wind is carried out to every direction. But if you are not going to know the truth, then the truth will deliver you and I from whatever thing that we are going to. Whether you and I believe it or not, Jesus Christ is the only way. Whether we accept it or not, Jesus Christ is the only truth. Whether we, 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 we obey it or not, Jesus Christ is the only life. John chapter 1 verse 4, is the Bible says, In him was life. And the life was the light of men. So Jesus Christ is the man who has the true life. And that life, when you encounter it, you become the light among your people. Jesus Christ is the only way. Is the way that when you walk on it, you will not fall. Is the way that the end will end you a hard way. Jeremiah 29 verse 11. God said, I know the thought I think towards you. He said, the thought of peace, not of evil. To give you what, and this, to take you toward an expected end. Jesus Christ is the only way that when we walk on it, we are going to end in what? A better please jesus christ is the only the truth that when you take everywhere you go it he will the, the truth will guide you jesus christ is only the life apart from the life of christ there's no other life doctors docket are saying that they can give you life but at the end of the it, at the end of it, the only one that will finalize the life in you is Christ. Money can help you to buy everything, but the money cannot finalize the life to your life. You can build a luxurious house and mansions. You can sleep on the on the high density mattress, but at the end of the day. You only wake up because Christ has given you and I life. So I hereby declare, propose to you, that all the rumors, all the doctrine that is moving on the social media, that Jesus is not the only way to heaven. Jesus Christ, according to the Bible, Jesus Christ is the way, the truth, and the life. And no one will say God, no one will go to the Father except to Him. Accept the man Jesus Christ. Whether you are a celebrity, whether you are a singer, a secular singer, whether you are a gospel singer, you are a man of God, you are a child of God, 
you are from a different tribe, different religion, if only you acknowledge that Jesus, if only you draw close to that Jesus, you see the Father, because he's the only way. That through that, you and I are going to see the Father. May the Lord bless you. And I salute you all. May the Lord bless you. And may God give you grace. And may God help us to stand and proclaim the truth. In Jesus' name, amen.